dear future husband. Um, <laughs> um, as always, you're probably seeing me in the same clothes a few times. This shirt. Well, in my defense, I have two of these shirts. Um, and I'm the kind of person who will wear the same clothes again and again and again and again. Like, like I, at one point in my life, I had so many shirts, it was so difficult to decide, that I threw them all away. No, I kid. I did not throw them all away, I actually donated them. Um, yeah, but I just felt like, you know, I needed to be able to uh, just make it really easy for myself so that I don't have to think about what to wear. I just simplified everything, like I threw everything out and like, or like gave it away or like packed it all up and that sort of thing. Because... You know, it's just easier. So you've probably seen me in the shirt. I've, in my defense, like I said, I've got two of these shirts. But you've seen me before. Anyways, uh, as always, ignore the hair. Because that comes with the territory. Today it's choosing to be clouds of Zeus. But <laughs> so I, today I wanted to ask you something that... Um, I want to know what you're craving. You know, and I know that sounds so bloody wrong. Especially with that, you know, I did this like... Rewind! I want to know what you're craving. <laughs> no, I actually didn't do anything like that. But you can rewind and see for yourself. But no, um, yeah, I want to know what you're craving. Because like, if you think about it, right, there's, there's so many ways to answer that question. There is, what are you craving right now? There is, you know, what are you craving for life? You know, what do you want more of in life? You know, that sort of thing. So, let me answer my side of the story. What am I craving right now? Set. Sex, but no, <laughs> but like I mean it in the sense that I I mean it like the whole intimacy thing, you know. Like like I my one of my love languages is touch. Uh, it took me a few years to figure that out how much touch or you know, just physical contact means to me. Uh, so when I say I crave sex, I think I crave the intimacy aspect of it. You know, the cuddles, the hugs, just having someone with you, being with you, being around you, that sort of thing. You know. So I can guarantee you that, you know, uh, when we do start going out, or we do finally start meeting, when we meet each other, I'm going to be very touchy-feely, so deal with it. Okay? <laughs> and you better respect it. Just saying. Uh, so you yeah, now, um, generally, frat chicken. <laughs> this is the problem, right? You should never watch... YouTube videos where people go and like review food or try out food or compare food. Like I watched this frat chicken video where like, you know, uh, these two Singaporeans, Dikosh and Amanda were, um, you know, eating fried chicken. And I swear to God, ever since then, I've been craving fried chicken. I really, really good fried chicken. And I don't even like fried chicken. The chicken. Boned chicken. I like chicken 65. No bones. Very easy. But yeah, you know, just frat chicken. Um, I think I'm also craving more influence uh, in the sense that um, I wish the works that I do, the art that I create, the things that I make is able to reach more people, you know? Um, I know that, you know, things like this take time and I know that, you know, uh, it's, it's a slog and I know that it's a slow process and everything like that, but I just really more people knew the work that I'm doing. But yeah, <laughs> you know, uh, just things like that. I'm also craving... I wouldn't mind more money, let's be honest. Let's just put that out in the universe. Gods and goddesses of prosperity. I would like more money. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> I'm craving more... I'm craving you. I mean, but I think you already know that. Like, hello. We are in episode... I don't know what already by now. Uh, I'm craving... What else am I doing? Hmm. I'm craving more books. Like, you know, really good, damn good books to sit down and read and that sort of thing. I'm craving things like that. Um, I'm starting to sound like a pregnant woman. I know, like, but everybody's got cravings, you know? Things that they want, things that they desire, things that they, in that moment they want. What am I some chocolate? <laughs> you know, I'm also a sugar-holic, dessert-holic, I was going to say orgasm-holic, but I don't think that works. In the mouth. Oh God, I'm sounding so bloody wrong. I mean in the sense like, you know, <laughs> like foodgasm. You know, like really, really good food and you're like, oh my God. You know, that's something. Um, 
What else? Look at the duck. Yeah, I think that's about it. I think that's what I'm craving, you know, like. So this is a slightly shorter love letter. Um, I'd love to know what you're craving in this moment, you know, or any moment when we finally meet. Oh, I remember something now. I mean, I'm not craving this, like, it's subtly sidetracked, but that's me, you know, I get sidetracked all the time. That's perfectly normal. You know who I am. Um, I was just thinking, because I was going to mention how, like, you know, I've, you've seen me in the shirt before, and that, like, you know, I've already worn it before, and all of those things. Uh, like I said, you know, I like, I like to wear the same things again and again. You should know this, that when we start dating each other, when we start, you know, living together, or maybe even before we start living each other together, I am going to steal your clothes. I will freaking steal your clothes. I don't care. The size might be an issue, but I'm assuming you're about the same size. So I'm going to steal your clothes. Just saying. You're welcome to steal mine, but I am going to steal your clothes. I am going to be one of those boyfriends. Just saying. So yeah, am I craving anything else? Let's see. What else am I craving? And I think that's it. So I'm craving sex. Intimacy, that something. I'm craving fried chicken and really good food. I'm craving you. Mm-hmm. I'm craving good books, you know. And I'm craving impact and influence, you know, being able to. Oh, money, 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 money. I'm craving money. But, you know, impact and influence. And just being able to reach more people, make more people laugh and smile, um, make the world a better place, you know. Anyways, babe, I'm hoping you are having an awesome week. Um, I have had a very slow week. So I've sort of allowed myself to do that. I've been working on some cool stuff, so that has allowed me to sort of get back into the groove and just get back to doing all the things that I love, you know. And, you know, this video is going up today, you know. Hey, I'm late. But anyways, this video is going up today. But I have something pretty cool planned out for this Friday. Because I started something new. Jeng, jeng, jeng. So come back to the channel on Friday or subscribe get notifications yeah anyways uh, I love you babe I hope you're okay um, as always thinking about you uh, just hoping you're alright hoping you're doing your own thing and just being awesome and just living life and living life and doing all of those things and I can't wait to hear all of those stories when we finally actually meet bye Sam take care see you in Friday <laughs>